Hello, my dear folks. Welcome to the show, Jack Chow on the East West Show with the Genie TV. Uh, today on this show, we're talking about a very, very serious issue uh, in commemoration to the 70th anniversary of winning World War II. There are people uh, getting busy from different approaches. One of the approach is uh, included, that is the artistic approach. Uh, that we feel proud of. For that, I would like to be proudly presenting my good friend Christopher Lee, director and producer to you. <laughs> to him, I give let's give him a warm welcome to the show. Thank you. Right. Right. Thank you very much. Okay, I want to make sure no more long face. All right, okay. just I want everybody to smile like I do, right? like ha 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 like that guy. <laughs> okay, Chris, well, you're welcome to the show. Okay. All right. Thank you. And Chris has brought along his latest masterpiece, ma masterpiece, the very, very super high profile masterpiece, Last Tear, which we'll later on go into step by step. And to his right hand side is Miss Choi, the Suyang Choi of Korea University of Art. You are welcome to the show. <laughs> hey, am I right with your name? Correct. Your name? Correct, right? Suyang Choi. Suyang Choi. Good, good, good. Very good. And to my left hand side is a young man, Mr. Kim. Ju Kim. Ju Sing Kim. Ju Sing. Ju Kim. So, and he is uh, from uh, the uh, what we call Kong Yong Kwan. Kong Yong Kwan University, University of Korea. Welcome to the show. Thank you. And to his left hand side is Wu Jin Yu. A uh, beautiful young lady, both of them are. I'm so excited about. Don't get me wrong, but I'm, I'm, I like a beautiful woman, all right? Okay, no. There's no, nothing wrong with that, right? So, and uh, she's also from uh, Korea University of Art. Am I right? Welcome to the show. Uh, there's a film documentary, Last Tear. Last Tear. The Last Tear. Yeah, but. The last tier, the last tier, the last tier, very, very important. Uh, that I was informed of yesterday, and I had hard time sleeping last night because of that. Uh, it wasn't until this morning did I get to the point that I wanted, whereby with the link I was directed to a little teaser of the film. Uh, to be honest, I'm not a soft person. I consider to be myself, I'm myself to be strong. I would say to tell you, my folks, into like one and a half or probably less than one and a half minutes into the teaser, I was crying. I was so crying. I was so crying. I knew I was going to touch some kind of hardcore evidence of history that thanks to the efforts of Mr. Lee, Christopher Lee, director and producer of The Last Tear and his wonderful team. Uh, later, I will give you a chance to start with the uh, uh, day one concept and then to each member of the team, wonderful team, uh, I would like to give uh, my salute. Right. So, that's it. I really came to wonder, so how you, in the first place, came to the idea about creating that film, please. Okay. Um, it, obviously, it's a long story. Mm -hmm. Do I look at the camera with you? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, 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 whatever. Okay. Yeah. Um, I, I grew up mostly in California, not mm -hmm. knowing much of our mm -hmm. uh, heritage. I am Let's Korean, mm -hmm. a Korea f from Korea, but I uh, grew up here most, most of my life mm -hmm. as a Korean American. Mm -hmm. I don't know much about history, you know, and mm -hmm. the culture and the heritage. Uh, um, and uh, ironically, I live a uh, few blocks away from the Comfort uh, Women statue in Glendale, California. I see, I see, I see, I see. All so right. I never had an interest in me because of mm -hmm. the fact that uh, it is a history that happened a long time ago. Mm -hmm. um, and, uh, and also having uh, friends who are not only Japanese but Japanese Americans. Mm -hmm. And also knowing that there has been an issue about this particular topic for mm -hmm. many many years and mm -hmm. there's also an um, organization that's been very active mm -hmm. as you know having voice for these uh, ladies mm -hmm. for many many years and mm -hmm. 
politically involved, you know, demanding the poli official apology to mm -hmm. the Japanese, the, the, right. yeah, the mm -hmm. nation the, or the country. Mm -hmm. So it never interested in me because of that reason. Didn't want to be involved and offend people, mm -hmm. although it is important for our her heritage. Mm -hmm. So when I heard from um, the school that I usually work with, uh, mm -hmm. I work with various schools. Uh, Universities and colleges here. I see. Uh, it, you know, especially after the uh, the first movie I produced, the, the Fading Away. Mm. Uh, that is also a historical uh, documentary based on the Korean mm. War. Mm. But we had no soldier in the movie. It's all about mm. the the separation of a family. I see. A very emotional approach to 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 understand the history, mm -hmm. and that's ex exactly what we did uh, with the. The, the last year. I see. Yeah. I see. So we are uh, collaborating with the university, one of the university, mm -hmm. uh, Johns Hopkins, the School of International Studies. I see. And within that, there's a, a department or a study called the U.S. Korea Institute, and they do a lot of uh, the policies around the Korea, the issues mm -hmm. about history. So, mm -hmm. so, so they we work partially funded um, by them. Uh, with the common interest uh, of uh, educating mm. ourselves mm. uh, and the students of uh, other other generation. I see. So me as a second generation to mm. the the victims of the the these uh, of the the women ladies, woman, yes. yes uh -huh. Then 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 the third generation as a yeah. student that I teach. Mm. Yeah. So we have a. Uh, not only professional like myself and mm -hmm. others involved, uh, but we have uh, 14 other students, mm -hmm. not just from Korea, but Korean Americans, mm -hmm. second generation, and also non-Koreans, interested in our interest in our cultures and heritage. Yeah. So some of them we actually met during the development, mm -hmm. during our filming. I see. I see. Uh -huh. uh, so uh, we didn't know how much of an interest they had mm -hmm. on this mm -hmm. particular topic. All right. And and also. We want to make sure that we're not doing this just because of the 70th anniversary of our Independence Day, uh -huh, uh -huh. which it, which it just happened on August 15th. Mm -hmm. you now we want to make sure these are these are remembered, um, and not not for the political reason, but more mm -hmm. of an emotional way. Uh -huh, we, yeah, uh -huh. we want to find these ladies uh, as our own harmony. You know, the word harmony is a uh, grammar. Harmony, yeah, yeah. harmony. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's not harmony and like a music. Mm -hmm. yeah. Their harmony, we call it harmony. Harmony, as like, like the address, address to grandmother. Yeah, grandmother. Yeah. Uh -huh. And then when we uh -huh. met this lady, they, mm -hmm. they don't want to be called comfort women. Mm -hmm. They are right, harmony mm -hmm. of someone, All right. whether they are married or not. Very good, yeah. very good. Uh, I would have to come back to <laughs> man my introduction. I would start the whole thing with uh, a group, wonderful artistic group called Fading Away Movie Series Production, which is a company that my good friend Christopher Lee has uh, established, an acting director and producer. The film, the documentary, with the title The Last Tear, to, to be precise, is a issue is on the issue of a so-called comfort woman to which the comfort women themselves argue they do not agree they prefer to be called harmony meaning grammar in original language of uh, korean. korean so let's give them respect by addressing them as the harmonies rather than comfort woman right so Yet it is, no matter how you look at it, from a historical point of view, from a political point of view, from a human race point of view, it is atrocity, mm. right? It is atrocity. According to Director Lee, he triggered by the concept that how come in the history such thing happened going into libraries to, to dig out uh, archives, to dig out the information, he found himself surprised. My next question, of course, we go into the film later, right? Sure. My next question is that I really find it interesting that you, as a second generation, mm -hmm. get yourself busy into the digging, the mm -hmm. process of digging mm -hmm. of history, mm -hmm. and yet you get third generation involved, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So what is the purpose, exact purpose, mm -hmm. for you, for him, mm -hmm. to get involved? And I'm going to ask you the same thing. Mm -hmm. Why are you involved? 
right? Mm -hmm. So nothing happened with you. You way, way will go back history. Mm -hmm. How you get so serious? And by the way, a long face. <laughs> uh, <laughs> all right. Uh, by the way, a long face. With that, yeah. why? There yeah. got to be a reason, right? Yeah. So prepare yourself. Prepare yourself. <laughs> Prepare yourself, young man. Yeah. You're going to tell <laughs> us you why. Say, yeah, you I want to make a point. Yeah. I want to make a point. Go yeah. ahead, Chris, please. So, you know, the key word is communications. 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 Uh -huh. um, how, we, how, how our, our ancestors, especially uh, my parents' age, uh, mm -hmm. who had went through the Japanese occupation for 30 years, mm -hmm. uh, and they survived that, survived that, and then they, they have to face the Korean War. Mm -hmm. the, and that's kind of the one reason why how our immigration began for as a Korean American. Uh -huh, uh -huh. The our country was just developing, and our country was never a uh, land of plenty. Mm -hmm. And the you know also in the movie, uh, one of the lady that we interview as a main character, she mm -hmm. said, "I was captured as a Kung Fu woman because, not because of my fault, because we didn't have the nation." Mm -hmm. that, that was a very strong yeah, message. Yeah, yeah, that's so strong message, yes. This is how we, be, we came, because the parents mm -hmm. had no food to eat, not enough education, and mm -hmm. the only thing they could do for us is to properly... To sacrifice provide. their yes. daughters. Yeah, so mm -hmm. that we were sent here, went oh, to harbors and all the good mm -hmm. schools. Mm -hmm. Now, careers developed. Mm -hmm. uh, now that we're in like top 20 in the economy, mm -hmm. well-established um, education uh, you know, we received. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But now what created is the competition mm -hmm. among ourselves. Mm -hmm. Everybody is well-educated, well-fed. Mm -hmm. That created another kind of a problem, a communication. Communication. Yes. Mm -hmm. And they're not, they don't, they're not understanding the sacrifice mm -hmm. that their parents are making mm -hmm. and also their parents are making. I see. So, mm -hmm. Through the process of research, we mm. discover these reasons why we were here mm. in the mm. U.S. and also why we were sent to good schools. All right, very good, yeah. very so good. Uh. And also, when we went to the comfort women issue, mm. in our textbook, when we flipped through our textbook mm. and uh, tested it in the university, mm. uh, we just didn't remember time and places and never knew what that meant. Yeah, those are just numbers. Yeah. That's so it. until mm -hmm. we actually went to Shanghai, Nanjing and all these other scholars and uh. Uh, people who were involved in the research mm -hmm. because our grandmother, Harmony, mm -hmm. were sent there. Mm -hmm. And and they, this is the first time they actually discovered it. So when mm -hmm. you so you have a book there and I was gonna explain about this mm -hmm. book. Yeah, 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 and before we do yeah. that, let me uh, call off for this segment. Okay. And my dear audience, today we're talking about a series production, Then Last Tear, created, directed, and produced by my good friend, Mr. Christopher Lee, at uh, Fading Away Film a Movie Series Production. And we're talking about with or without the commemoration mind of the 70th anniversary. Because commemoration only comes one day. On that day, you pay a salute, you commemorate. To keep it in your memory, ne never forgetting, never let it fade away is the other issue. That's right? correct. So that's the part Christopher focuses on. Let's take a short moment now. When we come back, we'll continue digging from his creative point of view and from these young people, those lovely faces, these young men too,